video lecture, I am going to discuss about how to install ASP.NET in Visual Studio 2022 on Windows 11 operating system. So first here, let's open any of your favorite browser. There you can write Visual Studio. And uh, now you can get here, this is Microsoft.com site. Click on there. And uh, after that, uh, scroll down. Now you can see here Visual Studio. This is for Mac and code here. So you can select any of your favorite type of Visual Studio Community Professional Enterprise. So here I'm going to select Enterprise. And now there one file that uh, automatically come Visual Studio Setup exe. Click this file. And after clicking, now you can see Visual Studio Installer. Click on this continue. And here, this is the file size 12 MB. It's uh, downloading the file. And uh, now it's verifying and it's doing the installation of the file. So getting the Visual Studio installer ready. So it will take few minute times. Now after that uh, there you can see here work logged inside there ASP.NET web development. So this is all detailed build web application using ASP.NET core. If you select uh, this option here you can see this list of things. So for ASP.NET uh, you, need, you need to select uh, this option. Okay, ASP.NET web development. And uh, no need to select anything extra. Okay. So now after uh, selecting this option, then you can here click on this install. And uh, after that, uh, here you can see Visual Studio Enterprise 2020. So download and downloading and verifying the file size 2.59 GB and uh, here this is the downloading with this speed so it will take some time to complete the all the process so now I so now I'm going to pause the video you can see Visual Studio Enterprise 2020 download that completed and installing package Visual Studio Enterprise 2020 that has completed download and install after that you need to click on this launch button so microsoft visual studio 2020 it's uh, opening and uh, after that uh, now you can see visual studio sign in so I here not now maybe later so click on not now you can do it later so select any of your favorite themes so let's select uh, light option and uh, here you can see general visual studio CSR web development so okay general select that no need to uh, select any one else right now and after that we are preparing for first use this may take a few minutes and to uh, new page that open visual studio 2020 so let's uh, click uh, on the create new project this is here console application asp.net core blazer so selecting there c sharp and after that uh, for uh, asp.net we need to select a uh, uh, web related thing web api web so here you can see sp.net code web and sp.net code api and after that uh, here you can see sp code and here sp.net code anyone can you can select from here so selecting sp.net mbc then after click on this next and web application one that's fine no need to change anything click on next then after this is not .NET 6.0 and uh, it uh, recently launched then after click on this create see this is web application 1 
and the this all components here model view and the uh, controller and uh, after that uh, oh, after that uh, this uh, page uh, or this console that open now I'm not going to do any modification there after that let's uh, click on this uh, web application one so click uh, there then you can get the one page that open inside the web browser and now you can see or uh, trust uh, sp.net core ssl certificate so click on this no you can also click on this yes option privacy so let's uh, click on this advanced continue local host unsafe then here new page open so here welcome or uh, web application this is project name home and privacy so here there is nothing inside the home this contents there and this is the privacy option okay so this is the way we can install asp.net in windows 11 operating system with uh, visual studio 2022 so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you